So, Infinity War is coming out on Blu-ray. I'm pretty sure I'm going to be doing a giveaway on the next couple of days for that. So, let's talk some Avengers 4. So, if you're new around here, make sure to subscribe for all the Marvel-based videos. So, I've got some major, major confirmed news that no other channel is actually reporting so what is avengers 4 absolutely no one knows doesn't matter how big their following is how what company works for absolutely no one understands what avengers 4 is this has been confirmed by the co-writer christopher marcus has insisted that the movie doesn't do what you think it does it is a different movie than what you think perhaps the reason is that we're focusing on the wrong models of time travel marvel have taken a far more interesting and less common used approach instead so wow guys this is mind blowing stuff so literally this is said that no one knows what avengers 4 is so let's get into it so some concept art has appeared online for ant-man which could possibly be the key to avengers 4 so due to these elite images of the behind the scenes images of avengers 4 which is why everyone thinks it's a time traveling movie we see the new york scene we see loki in chains we see thor with the milnor with the original long hair and so forth but does that really imply time travel? So since, since Ant-Man and the Wasp has come out there, it's been clearer. Careful for spoilers if you haven't seen it yet. I know it comes out in England this week, but there's something that kind of gives away that it could be the Quantum Realm travel. So the Quantum Realm is key to Ant-Man and the Wasp, and it's been confirmed it's also going to be key to the Captain Marvel movie that comes out next year. So it's possible that the idea is already there. In the aftermath of the Avengers, Tony Stark experienced flying through the wormhole that left his mind reeling. It's possible the experience transformed his mind a little, granted him a concrete awareness of the future. That's why he always knew about Thanos in his mind. He always, always knew it was coming. So there's been concept art of shrinking Hank Pym walking through a spectacle reality approaching a vest column of light. When he steps into the column, there's a flare as reality itself reconstructs around him. And then Hank finds himself stepping into a subreal representation of his own memories. So yes, are they traveling through their memories? Now this could be interesting because the bath technology that allowed tony stark to experience traumatic events in his life and help him deal with could it actually all be tied with them time traveling through memories thus far making it not really time travel so the concept art doesn't make it into the final movie although the memories were a key aspect of ant-man 2 plot with janet communicating with scott via her past but the idea of memory based form time travel was considered at a concept stage considering the quantum realm in the finished film has links to time travel and given marvel often some ideas for later movies as we know it has been confirmed that the quantum realm will be a massive part of phase four because obviously doctor strange travel through it briefly so this is taken from another like, kind of website which i thought was interesting and seeing as i've got an avengers audience i thought why not share someone else's concept but break it down war stew style so let's break it down so the idea is vaguely reminiscent to one toy with by c.s lewis in his unfinished novel the dark tower this is a scientific fantasy story in which a group of scientists are toying with the idea of time travel they conclude physical travel through time is impossible the atoms you need in order to reconstruct your physical form are already in use lewis story suggests that the consciousness can travel in time though in fact he proposes that the memory itself is a form of time travel within the human mind literally revealing the past this is mind-breaking stuff thus can be caused by human mind having glimpsed the future presumably whilst in a dream lewis of course went one step further and he suggested other dreams tap into alternate dimensions and parallel realities all this may sound like science fiction but it became respected scientific theory damn it was like a theory to describe 
this mental time travel. So how is this going to play a role in Avengers 4, Phase 4, and the future of Marvel movies? Well, it might not actually. This is just a theory. So it could explain why Tony Stark became so confident of another alien attack was common, though he couldn't explain it because remember he had the vision. His mind has already experienced it later in Age of Ultron, Scarlet Witch using her powers to cast visions into his mind of the Avengers. This could again be examples of the glimpse of alternate realities and possible futures rendered crypto and confusing because they were only half perceived and originated from someone just learning to use their powers. This theory is actually really good. Now, according to the Ant-Man and Wasp, when a human enters the Nexus, they would gain access to their memories and thus they can rewrite history. Presumably this is done by projecting their consciousness back into the memory they're glimpsing. Their past self would perhaps encounter their future self or else experience a classicalistic moment in which they had sudden awareness of the personal fu personal future. How would this transform physically? See Ant-Man in the event in the events of the Avengers is unclear, but the quantum realm is abstract enough to allow the time travel may be physical but powered by memories this would explain how and why the og avengers survived the device on the hands of tony stark and scott lang etc in set photos imply time traveling is going to happen and it's going to allow them to interact with memories so is it time travel after all or is it just memories because every scene that has been kind of leaked well not leaked you know when they make movies and that out and the public shooting you know people walk around with cameras like atlantic films and people like that cool guys like that um stuff will get out so everything we've seen has been previous events we've not seen any they've traveled to any kind of timelines or anything that we haven't already encountered in the mcu history obviously if that was going to be the case it would be green screen in, in a studio and you get nowhere near it but i really think this theory has a lot of legs so what if when the co-writer for the movie christopher marcus was actually true when he says it's a different movie than what you think it is perhaps the reason is we're focusing on the wrong models of time travel so what happens if it is time travel but the reason they says no time travel is because they are time traveling through the memories yeah i know let's hopefully you understand this video so guys let me know in the comment box down below do you think they're time traveling through memories i think this could reveal the future of the mcu now if you've got any ideas videos for videos drop the comments down below or email me at warstewbusiness at gmail.com let me know if you want me to do an infinity war giveaway the same email address drop the comments down below and i will be doing a giveaway pretty soon for a bunch of blu-rays for infinity war because infinity war and avengers 4 to help this channel literally grow so i need to give away some free shit so anyway guys please like subscribe and comment and i'll catch you in another video very soon guys catch you later